Hi everyone, this is Elizabeth. Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, it's good to have you. Today I'm going to be doing a very quick video and I promise this time it's a very quick video on how I save my digitized uh, files on Embird uh, ready for my Janami 550 embroidery machine. So here I have a, um, a file here that I've digitized myself and it's going to be an uh, applique so just before I save it I just want to have a look at how it's going to stitch out so let's generate the stitches first which is already done and let's use a simulator and I'm going to speed it up really quickly So that first stitch is my placement stitch. Followed by the tack down stitch. And lastly, the satin stitch. Let's speed it up even more. So I am happy with the way that looks like it's stitching out. Okay, brilliant. Right, so now, first of all, I am going to... I already saved this file, but I'm going to save it again because I um, made it a little bit bigger. So it's saved. And now I'm going to bring it into editor so here is my design in the editor part of the Ember software and now I need to save it as a uh, Janome stitch file so I'll go file save as I'll skip all that And this is already ticked uh, JEF, which is the Gen Genomi um, stitch file. I'm going to press OK. And here it's going to ask where you want it saved. So I'm going to go into my flash drive and look for I've got so many files here <laughs> I need to find here we go open and I'm going to name this uh, mum mum jef Okay, and it says here, save as type, JEF, and save. Okay, and we are good. You could print, okay, all the kind of like information to go with this uh, file here, but I won't be doing that. So press okay. Design mum has not been saved to the cloud. Yep that's fine I don't want it saved to the cloud right now I'm going to check to see if it's actually saved on my flash drive so I'm going to go into where I saved it and it's right there so mum jef which is the format that I saved it in which is the Janome uh, stitch file so when I put that into my um, embroidery machine, it should come up. So that is how you save your designs in Embird 
so that you are able to then transfer it to your Janome embroidery machine ready to stitch. Thank you for watching. I hope you found that useful or interesting. If you did, please give my video a thumbs up and do subscribe if you haven't already done so. Uh, you can find me on TikTok and Instagram under the handle Eliz Art Design Studio. As always, don't have a good day, have an amazing day and see you soon. Bye!